All right, of 100 vaccines in the clinical trials right now for COVID-19, seven, seven are nasal sprays. Well, how soon could another method of getting the vaccine be available to you? 10 TV's Lindsay Mills verifies. It's a question we got from a viewer, Jason Jones. I have heard a while ago that they had developed new delivery systems for the vaccines, nasal spray and micro needle patches. Are they available? Our resources are Dr. Joe Castaldo, an infectious disease expert from Ohio Health, the CDC, National Institutes of Health, and a recent research article, Scent of a Vaccine. A lot of people do have fears of needles. That causes a lot of anxiety. Let's talk about nasal spray first. There are 100 COVID vaccines growing through clinical trials. Seven are nasal sprays. This technology is not new. For example, flu mist for the flu. If you look at what a vaccine needs to do, the vaccine needs to stimulate the immune system. There are immune cells all throughout your body, so you could stimulate the immune system through a shot, which is what the COVID-19 vaccines are. You can also stimulate the immune system through your mucous membranes, like spraying something in your nose. However, no vaccines like this are cleared for COVID yet, and it's not likely they will be anytime soon. Now, microneedle patches, according to the National Institutes of Health, in a study led by two researchers from University of Pittsburgh in 2020, the vaccine delivered by microneedle patches triggered an immune response in mice. However, more research is needed to determine how long that will last. And right now, researchers are working to obtain permission for human clinical trials. According to the CDC in 2015, researchers tested this technology for the measles vaccine, claiming a safer, more full proof delivery system that's painless and effective. So we can verify, yes, COVID-19 vaccines delivered by nasal spray and microneedle patches are being studied. However, no, they're not available yet and likely won't be for a while. I would say if those vaccines were available today, it would probably uh, alleviate some anxiety of people getting vaccinated. Have something you'd like us to verify? Send us an email to verify at 10tv.com. With your verify, I'm Lindsay Mills.